where I have no impact on who Newsmax chooses or does not choose to interview. C Cardillo sending out tweets in support of you and, and Mr. criticizing. Mr. Cardillo is, has First Amendment rights like every other American. Claiming he's your great friend. He is a good friend of mine, but, he, he, but I don't tell him what to tweet. I don't tell him who to interview. He has First Amendment rights like everyone else. Two and two equals four, doesn't it? You have not. Is that a saint? No, no. Wild project. Wild. Is that a saint? Proof. Evidence, Larry. Is that evidence. A saint? Proof, Larry. Evidence. Proof. Evidence. Not not guessing on your part with nothing. You have nothing. This proves nothing. That's what you told Mueller, right? You have nothing. That's what your clients uh, argued at the uh, trial. I'm not right? going to discuss the criminal You're case. Right. If you want to keep insulting me, this will be uh, over. I'm not, insult back I'm not the judge insulting like you. Like a little bitch. You, you, I'm doing what? If you want to keep insulting me, I will just end this and you go running back to the judge. Did you just okay? call me a bitch? I, you're acting like one. You're acting like one. Oh, you don't have anything, my question. friend. You got nothing. You right, have right. a wild guess. If you have some evidence that I communicated with Ruddy or Cardillo or Clemente or, or Cassandra, Fer produce it. You got nothing. You're not going to get anything by interviewing well, them because it's not true. I can produce it if you've withheld it, can I? I haven't withheld it. You've proof I withheld it. Do that. But you don't have to do that either. No, we'll, we'll look for it. Don't you worry. can look for it all you fucking want. You'll find nothing. Okay. Ask, <laughs> ask a question. This is just, this, it reaches a point of absurdity. Insane is, uh, I think, a colloquial expression, but when someone pulls facts out of the air for which they have no evidence whatsoever, which they're just guessing because they're unhappy that they can't be interviewed when they want to. Yeah, I think that's pretty crazy. At 227 in the InfoWars video, Stone falsely and misleadingly publishes that, this is in the, in the, in the uh, paragraph, 18. He, Corsi, was perfectly willing to lie, to perjure himself, saying that a memo he had wrote me was written on the 30th for the purposes of cover-up which is further proof that Jerry lied under oath. Now, what proof do you have that Jerry lied under oath? Substantial, because everything in that paragraph I said is accurate and true, and I could prove it if I needed to. Do you know whether or not he's working with Dennis Montgomery today? I do not know. Have you had contact with Dennis Montgomery? No, I have not. In fact, you have. No, in fact, I haven't. Feeble alcohol affected memory. You're, in fact, stating that Dr. Corsi is an alcoholic. Um, I can only assume that this memory had to be caused by something because it was inaccurate. But you untrue. didn't know whether he made the statement I, under the I've, influence of alcohol, did you? Uh, no, but I've certainly had drinks with him.